Hi, I'm Vince Battaglia. I work here at the Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory in the Battery Research Program. I specifically work on lithium-ion batteries supported by the Department of Energy in the Batteries for Advanced Transportation Technologies Program. We're uh, supported to do research for batteries for electric vehicles, like the one I'm driving now. This is the uh, GEM car that's run on lead-acid batteries. We'll probably go about 50 miles in this thing before it has to be charged again. And most consumers aren't happy with that type of product, and so the Department of Energy is supporting research to develop uh, advanced technologies like lithium ion so that we can go 150, maybe up to even 300 miles in a vehicle. We're working specifically at high energy density batteries, a lot, of, a lot like the batteries that are in the uh, camcorders and uh, cell phones, but uh, the problem with those batteries is that they don't last long. And so we're, not only are we trying to make those batteries themselves better, we're trying to make them last 15 years instead of perhaps the three years you're, you're accustomed to. And what's that going to do? If we can make a battery that lasts like that, we're going to put it in a vehicle because vehicles last 10 to 15 years. And if we can do that, we can reduce the cost of that vehicle so that everyone can drive them. So now we're in our cell analysis facility. Here you'll see over 250 channels able to cycle 250 batteries at a time. Now some of the things we test here are some of the most advanced materials that are being developed across the country. Uh, not only in laboratories, but also in industry, so that we can compare our materials, the, uh, the materials being uh, developed here at Berkeley, as well as some of the, the leading universities in this country, and seeing how they're doing against these baselines and how well we're advancing the technology. So here at Berkeley Lab, I'm one of many scientists, postdocs, graduate students, and professors working together in some of the greatest facilities in the world on a lithium-ion technology for the next generation of electric vehicles, which we think is then the next step to a sustainable transportation infrastructure.